Hey, what's up guys? You guys know me, I'm Jay. Today we got some more Battlefield Hardline news on the upcoming DLC Criminal Activity. Today we got some news on new weapons, but let's waste no time, let's get right into the news. First up, we'll be looking at the M1A1 Tommy Gun, which is going to be the free gun to every player. No matter if you're a premium member or even have the DLC pack, everyone gets it for free. This thing is going to be an amazing SMG, especially when it has that gold uh, cam on it, it looks amazing. But the only setback on this thing is you can only change two things on it, which are the ammo clip size and the grip. But other than that, the thing's amazing. Next up, we got the KSG-12, which is basically, like I said in the last video, the UTS shotgun from Battlefield 4. The thing is the um, bullpup shotgun. thing has amazing range, and thing looks just amazing in the game. And I'd say for this new shotgun, it basically has to be the better one of the few because this thing has a great amount of punch, a good clip size of at least 14 um, rounds, and this thing packs a good punch at distance as well, but not too far of a distance. But this thing packs a great deal of punch for the amount of gun it is. Next up, we got the FAL, which is the new enforcer weapon, which has to say it has to be the big fan favorite at EA because that thing is what everyone uses, and this thing a big mouth punch for the gun. The thing basically is the new freaking M16A3 in the game. The thing is the best in the game and this thing has like the best ray of fire and everything. Next up we got the SG510 which is going to be the new enforcer weapon. Again enforcer is getting a lot of love. This thing it does have a slower amount of um, fire rate compared to the um, FAL but this thing is still a great weapon. Has low recoil and the thing does pack a big mouth punch. Next up, I want to talk about the new ammo, which is the breaching rounds, which basically you can just equip on the weapon and just select by clicking down or V on PC. And this thing basically can destroy any sabotages on doors and goes straight through the door so you don't have to open it, but it does give away your position. But next up, we'll be looking at the new counts which are coming into the DLC, which are just the skull variants of each cow. And I have to say, these camels look sick. Especially the desert camo on the KSG. That is going to be my new favorite camo. And I have to say, that just blows my mind. Next up, we'll be looking at the Tactical Toolkit. Which is basically something that can help you capture objectives fast faster. No matter what it is, hot wire or conquest, it'll make it go a lot quicker. Make it count like there's two people on an objective. But I hope you guys did get all that because that's all I have to say for today. I hope you guys did enjoy. But before you guys do leave, I want to make sure to give some credit to Stonemount64. He's an amazing guy. He did supply the footage for today's video. I'll make sure to put his channel link in the description below. But I hope you guys did have an amazing day today. Make sure to like and subscribe for everything up to date, battlefield related. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. So peace out till next time.